Hi everyone, Mrs. Fayetta here with the week eight update. This week we will start the Google certification exam online. And the following students you see here are the ones that passed the test in February. We took the test right before spring break and I got the results during spring break. And if you are one of the 11 students that passed, I am still waiting for your certificates from Google and I promise, promise, I will mail it to you as soon as I get it. All right, so here we go. Session one is 520 through 529. Not every single day, but I um, staggered it so we have time to meet in between and get situated and add the extensions we need and answer questions and things like that. This is the first time that I um, have given a test when I'm not in the room, let alone all in different locations. So thank you for your patience. Now, the Zoom meeting codes for the past three weeks have stayed the same. I, It is on the next slide and make sure you add it. We will meet the day before the test and maybe 30 minutes before the test, just to make sure everybody is set up. If you don't use your real name in Zoom, I will not add you in or admit you into the room because I don't know who you are. Uh, usually the test, the meetings are on Wednesday and Fridays, but because of testing, we will meet the day before the test on Wednesday. Uh, like Tuesday, we will meet for Wednesday's meeting and on Thursday we'll meet for Friday's test. So if you miss the test, you have to somehow get the code from me so how the test works is you will get a code and that code is specific to you and i cannot post this code based on the google testing rules so you'll have to call me on my um google voice app this is on my computer and i'll text you now during the test if you have problems just text me and I will get back to you as soon as I can. I obviously can't talk to people um, all at the same time or it's too difficult to Zoom. Maybe I'll leave a Zoom room open and I'll take calls as is, but um, I don't know. We'll figure it out. So this is, like I said, this is the first time that uh, I tested students when they are at home and we are not in the same room. So please be patient. You have to add the ProctorU extension. Here is the link, please click on it. It has to be the Google Chrome extension ProctorU. If Firefox comes up, do not add it. That is not the one we're using. If Firefox does come up, it is because you have to update your extension on your computer. And these are the types of things that we will talk about during the Zoom meetings, just because um, some people are still confused but if you're pretty confident that you can do it, then go for it, um, do it on your own, and then just wait for the next directions. Okay, this is how it looks when you click on that link. Now my click is gray because, actually I was in incognito because I was already signed in, but you will click the blue button that says add to Chrome, and then you will see it in your little window above that you added the extension. Okay, so it looks like this, proctoru.com, Chrome extension, please. Once again, Chrome extension. Now, um, this is the meeting for schedule for Wednesday. It's very hard to book the times because I, maybe they're busy right now. So I'm getting the first available times. I'm trying not to make it too early or too late. Now, once I press the launch button, you guys have 90 minutes to take the test. So, if the test is at 1.45, um, the Zoom meeting, let's schedule it at one o'clock and then I'll launch the test once everybody's on. So um, once everybody's on and I can see everybody's logged in, I will launch the test. Now I have not um, posted Thursday's group because I'm still trying to get a time and Friday's group is fifth period, but I still not have posted the time. Also, Friday's group will include first and fourth period students that wanted to take it this Friday for some reason. Now, remember, you have up to three times to take the test. Jen, yes, already paid for it. So it's not that big of a deal if you don't 
pass this first time. It's actually a good learning experience and there's nothing to lose if you fail two times and take it the third time. I mean, just more experience, right? But I think we're really, really prepared this time. One more thing that I want to say and really emphasize, do you see how I have all these tabs up here? Do not close out the tab during the test. If your test crashes, it's really hard for me to help you when I'm not there with you. You're going to have to call me or text me and I will call you back and help you. But um, please, 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 we learned from the first time testing, do not close any tabs. Do not close any tabs. And everybody's asking me, Ms. Vera, what if we cheat? What if we cheat? Well, you know what? I will never know. If you cheat, you will not be recorded with the camera because you're under 18. But um, I hope you don't cheat. I don't think you guys will cheat. Um, anyway, it's 90 minutes. How are you going to cheat even though... You Google it, number one, you have, um, what if you're locked out of your screen? I won't be able to help you. Just do your best. You know what I mean? Do your best. Um, I don't know. I won't know if you cheat, but I really hope you don't. And I trust that you won't. And your parents are there. And um, I'm sure that they will keep an eye on you and trust you as well. But, you know, I trust you guys. I think I know you can do it. We've been on these lessons every day for the past two months now this time around we're studying even harder and my goal is for you guys to get certified before june 10th before um school ends and how great would it be you can say hey like i was certified during quarantine you know you got a certification and it will feel like a super amazing accomplishment so good luck this week I will keep you posted, read everything that you need to read, read it once, twice, three times if you have to. People here, thank you for your patience with your certificate. Um, here's my number if anybody needs to call me or text me. Actually, I'm really bad at answering right away sometimes. I don't hear it or I'm doing something else or I'm talking to someone else. So if you leave a text message, I'm always sure to get back to you as soon as possible. So leave me a text. Um, come into the Zoom meetings. The code is the same. Good luck. I'm so excited. You know, there's only 20 schools in the United States doing this pilot, and we are one of the very few middle schools doing it. Gen Yes is pay for, paying for it. Um, we're the first middle school in Glendale, and I'm just proud of you guys for trying your best to take it. And I hope you do take it. People are asking me why. I don't need it. Well, it just looks really good on your record. And one day, you guys will thank me. You're going to look back when you're 20 years old and say, oh, I remember when I was certified, when I was 13, when I was 14, and Ms. Fayetta made me take this test. And I was able to earn an industry certification. So please, guys, just try your best. It's OK if you mess up. Um, you know, don't worry about it. Just take your time, do your best. And um, you can use the Google help button here, but you don't want to depend on it because sometimes it just takes too long. And I would actually focus on the sheets. And real quick, while we're here, I would study, I'm going to post this for the people that want to study. I would study the lessons. You know those 11 lessons that I've been posting? I would go back and study those lessons, especially Google Sheets parts one and two, because that is really important. So right here, it's the collection of 11 sessions. I will add this to our list. You don't even have to sign in. Just go ahead and go to the site, applied skills with google.com, and here you go. These are all the videos I've been posting. Study this main section like crazy because one and two is the hardest, but um, you can do it. All right. Uh, have a great week. It's week eight. I will be back to give you more updates. Um, and tomorrow is Tuesday because I'm filming this on Monday and we're meeting at 1115. If anybody wants to join our Zoom, it's always the same. So the people that keep losing the Zoom address, it's here, you guys. Okay. And like I said, sign in with your real name. Talk to you later. Um,
Have a great week. Bye, guys.